Hi, I'm Mr. Cast at Mill Middle School, and you're watching West Virginia History in two minutes or less. Today, we're going to be talking about the Tug Valley Chamber of Commerce. It's not like your typical Chamber of Commerce because it's made out of coal. Here we go. Located in the Hatfield McCoy Mountains tourist region, it's one of the most unique buildings in West Virginia that can be found in Williamson, West Virginia. Since 1933, the Williamson Coal House has drawn tourists to Mingo County. The project was the idea of O.W. Evans, the general superintendent of the fuel mines of the Norfolk and Western Railroad. He wanted to honor how coal played such an important role in West Virginia's economy and history. An architect from Welch, West Virginia, H.T. Hicks, designed it. All of the materials and labor were donated from local businesses and townspeople. In fact, the coal was taken from the Winifred seam that mining companies in Williamson donated. The coal house is 1,600 square feet and has walls that are two feet thick. All four walls and two pillars are constructed of hand-sawn bituminous coal joined together by black mortar and weighs in at 65 tons. A statue of the Mingo chief, Chief Logan, stands in the front of the coal house. It is located right next to the Mingo County Courthouse. The coal house's sturdy construction has withstood four major floods, two of which reached the top of the arch in the entryway in 1977 and 1984. Every two years, a protective varnish is used to preserve the house's exterior. There are other coal houses that have popped up in West Virginia, such as this one in White Sulphur Springs that was created in 1959. It's been everything from a visitor center to a lounge with slots, a gift shop, selling coal jewelry, but none have been maintained like the coal house in Williamson. In 1980, it was added to the National Register of Historic Places. The coal house caught on fire in 2010, and after being repaired, it reopened to visit in 2011. It is owned by the Williamson Convention and Visitors Bureau and houses the Tug Valley Chamber of Commerce. If you're ever in the area, check out their little visitor center that has a little bit about the history of the area and the building as well as a gift shop.